be smart enough not to send money to a Nigerian prince. Maybe it's not that surprising that these two groups share similar business strategies. There is one final reason that the financial charlatans are intentionally unbearable. Building a personal brand as a professional rich jerk is a great way to attract people that want to get rich and don't really care what they need to do to get there. If these men posted ads promoting their sales training, then all they could sell is sales training. If these make themselves a public figure, then they can slap their brand on whatever is popular at the time. Not everybody wants to be a salesman, so to maximize the potential of their sales funnel, they can introduce all... It's a beautiful filter. It's a beautiful filter. It's like a confirmation to someone like, hey, yeah, don't worry. Even if you're willing to play dirty, I can help you. Alternative products, like training seminars on real estate investing, e-commerce, copywriting, day trading, and anything else that people associate with making a lot of money. Now, I hope you realize by now that paying to learn... There's got to be a huge drop off in people who give advice and, and people are like, man, I'm just, well, I'm just trying to get rich. You want to give me all these ethical ways to get rich that are going to take forever? Nah, I'm going to listen to someone else. That's got to be a huge point of drop off. Anything from these men is a truly terrible idea, but that doesn't mean you can't learn from them. These guys have mastered both the art of building a personal brand that attracts qualified customers and making the most out of the customers once they are in their sales funnel. You can learn a lot from these guys by learning from what they do and totally ignoring what they talk about. If you are trying to build a business, then study the tricks that these guys use to attract attention. Most businesses put all of the focus on the product that they are selling. These men are able to sell a terrible product because they instead focus on building a brand. Yes, that brand is a rich, slimy douchebag, but that's better than their branding being useless overpriced online trainings. I do hope you choose to build a better business around a better brand, but if you don't, I totally get it. After all, we are in the golden age of fraud. Go and watch that video if you've decided to go that way and need a bit of inspiration. Thanks again to Aura for making